of fish. It's a whole boatload of fish. <laughs> And after that first sighting, Bork called it a scaldron. As we now know, that sea dragon fills itself up with water, then heats it in its giant cauldron-like stomach. One blast from that hot water, and you're finished. We found out something surprising about scaldrons. If you want to train them, douse yourself with water. Turns out, they like anything that reminds them of home. <laughs> Look at what also lurks in the deep. It's the mighty Thunder Drum. This beast moves through the water like a tornado and is capable of delivering a sonic blast of pure dragon power. <laughs> the story goes that Bork got lost ice fishing and he stumbled across a Thunder Drum nest. That must have been quite a rude awakening, because when a thunder drum hatches from its shell, it makes a sound so loud, it rattles the sky! <laughs> now, here's a class that may stump you. What symbol is that? It's a symbol for the mystery class. We don't really know how these guys work. That's why they're a mystery. Is it a tree? Is it a rock? No, it's the Changewing. This strange dragon can disappear into any environment. Bork noticed that Changewings are curious creatures. And they display mimicking behavior. Whatever they see, they love to copy. <laughs> Change wings are known for their acid breath and their ability to hypnotize. But finding one takes a keen eye. Does being able to change color mean their skin is softer? For some, yes. And it makes them vulnerable to attack. So these dragons protect themselves in a strange way. Like this beauty. The Bone Nama. This odd creature collects the bones of dead dragons and makes itself an unusual coat of armor. <laughs> the best way to deal with this brutal bag of bones is to subdue it with force and fear and firepower. Sure, right. That's what you did, Gobber. <laughs> All right, all right, all right. You give a bone napper whatever it's looking for, and it's just like an overgrown puppy dog. Look, wh why don't we go on to the next class of dragons? Finally, strike class.